I'm Elliot Rodriguez, and this is your CBS Miami News Brief. Right now, let's get a check of travel weather from meteorologist Lisette Gonzalez. Hey, Elliot, it will be a cold start for Florida as we head into Friday morning to kick off the weekend. Highs will climb to the low 60s in South Florida, and we'll see highs in the upper 40s in Jacksonville. 30s, though, as we head through parts of the Carolinas for Raleigh and Charleston. Up through the Northeast, brutal Arctic air will be taking over as that bomb cyclone begins to push offshore. Still a little bit of lingering snow, but as you can see in Boston, only 13 degrees. 15 in New York City and 3 in Syracuse. And that cold air also will be across the Northern Plains. Dangerous conditions with two below in Fargo and the actual temperature only one in Minneapolis, nine in Chicago. We are seeing 40s and 50s though across the Southern Plains. And out on the West Coast, California will see highs in the upper 60s through Los Angeles. Could be very wet and wintry as we look towards the Pacific Northwest. High around 50 degrees for Seattle, 49 in Portland. Let's say thank you. A Florida based, truly authentic Japanese restaurant concept has opened its third eatery in downtown Doral. CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo has a look at it in this week's Taste of the Town. It's lunchtime here at Dragonfly Izakaya and Fish Market, located in the shops of downtown Doral. With two existing Florida locations, the first in Gainesville, the next in Orlando, this is the newest of the three. All are modern interpretations of Japanese mom and pop taverns. This 6,000 square foot venue with warm woods and a large sushi bar offers seating inside and out. It's a new take on Doral's growing dining scene. People are still trying to figure out what Doral is, but I think uh, us being over here, it's going to create something more into Doral customers, all those uh, people who want to try new things. The restaurant's adjoining fish market is a nod to the famous fish markets and the many popular street vendors in Japan. And there's something very unique about Dragonfly, something very traditional in Japan. Chef de Cuisine Masa Hamaya explains. This is about a month old. It's not that I forgot about it. It's we're really controlling. Uh, nobody else in Miami is doing it. It's called Age Bluefin Tuna, a scientific process where the outside is cut off to reveal the inside, a fresh and fatty delicacy. Uh, first of all, our sushi, uh, most of our sushi fish is aged. Age. From in between uh, one day all the way to one month old. Which is amazing, which I've never heard of before. Well, we do that in Japan uh -huh. very often, but not in Miami. We're the first ones. After slicing the aged tuna, Chef Masa adds his Japanese rice with a pop of wasabi and a paint of aged eel sauce. It's a three-year-old uh, aged sauce. We've got a lot of age on this plate. Lots of aging, just like, just like me. <laughs> like me. The proof is in the bite. The way we, we make sushi is a lot softer than other restaurants because we want everything to fall in your mouth. It's super soft. So that's the goal of having it kind of melt in your mouth. Next is a dragonfly signature roll that includes a fresh mixed crab with garlic chips. There's a little heat, a sweet, and a crunch. And that comes from? He, he is coming from garlic puree. And the crunch is, is coming from the garlic chips. For a hot meal, we try the short ribs. Chef adds a poached egg to bring creaminess to the sauce. That's crazy good. Yes, all the connective tissue has been broken down by braising for a long time. That's why it gets so really soft. So tender and soft, you don't even need teeth. Exactly. Truly delicious, Chef. And so let's tell everybody, how many days a week is Dragonfly open here in Doral? Seven days a week. Uh-huh. And Sunday brunch. And Sunday brunch as well, which is a different menu or the same? Different menu. All brunch right. menu. Brunch menu. With your taste of the town in Doral, I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News. Looks outstanding. Dragonfly Zakaya and Fish Market is located at 5241 Northwest 87th Avenue in Doral. And that's our newscast for now. You can always find us at CBSMiami.com and tune in to CBS 4 News at 5, 6, 7, and 11 for all the day's important headlines.